Greetings, this is Earthman, earthmansoil.com. God bless you guys. I hope you're doing well this day. And um, to the point, we are inoculating my compost pile. Um, not really, half is compost, half is soil I dug out of my last remaining Hoogle Hill because I am going to town this year by filling, I'm, I'm gonna try to do 150 to 200 five gallon bags. Um, and they're gonna each one have plants in them, different plants. And so I am inoculating the main part of my compost slash uh, soil. Um, and that's what it looks like. So what I did is I took a, a Grovana, which is an IMO3 product that we carry at earthmansoil.com. And it has a lot of different, uh, inoc you know, different type of beneficial bacteria, effective microbes. And uh, it also has some really neat uh, biostimulants such as yucca extract, seaweed extract, tricotinol, and uh, just a bunch of other stuff, humic and fulvic acid, amino acids. Um, and so, but the main thing is gonna be the life. And so what I did is I put a whole bunch on there and now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna spray it down with another product of ours, Grovana OS Liquid, which, uh, you know, is an amazing product and um i'm gonna spray it down and then today it's supposed to rain and tomorrow it's supposed to rain and so what's going to happen is that rain is going to soak the compost pile slash soil and those microbes will get buried into the soil and then once the rain ends i'm going to cover it up with some tarps and i'm going to let it sit for a couple of days and then i'm going to show you the result of that but my guess is you're going to see a whole bunch of mycocillin slash bacteria fungi action on top of this pile of earth so um, that's one way that i do it um, i wait till it rains and then i put it on there it soaks in for a day or two then i cover it with a tarp so it doesn't get exposed to the sun and the mycocillin forms and then after that i'm going to fold it in i might do it one more time maybe maybe not um but uh, we'll see what how much time i have but uh, there you go. I, you know, it's not hard to inoculate your soil. Sometimes you just take a little bit of my Grovana or IML3 and just mix it right into the soil, or you're doing what I'm doing here. And oh, what this basically is is an IMO4. Okay, this is an IMO4. IMO1 is the rice with the mycelium. IMO2 is when you mix brown sugar in with it. IMO3 is when you make, uh, make a, a liquid out of that and mix it with wheat bran and IMO4 is when you take that inoculated wheat bran and you put it onto your compost. So technically, this is an IMO4. So uh, may God bless you. I hope this lesson is, you know, helpful, you know, um, maybe, maybe not. Maybe you guys do this. Maybe you guys know more than I do. I don't know, um, but uh, this is what I do. So I hope it helps you. God bless you.